Welcome to Gursur Education. The topic of this video is, UGC Net Commerce Previous Paper Held in June 2011. Many multiple choice questions will be asked and you can practice these questions multiply. For further information about UGC Net, JRF, you can call or WhatsApp on phone numbers given in the screen. Let's get started. Question number 1. Two lists are given in this question. You have to match correct items of list 1 with correct items of list 2. The list 1. Environments. Contains the following items. A. Economic environment. B. Social environment. C. Political environment. D. Legal environment. The list 2. Components. Contains the following items. 1. Exim policy. 2. Customs. 3. Social values. 4. Business law and banking act. Below are given the options with different matches. You can pause the video and choose the appropriate answer. The right answer of the question is option. A. We suggest you to pause the video to analyze and learn the correct combination. Question number 2. Which of the following explains the process of planning? The option A is, goal oriented. The option B is, flexible. The option C is, time bound. The option D is, all of the above. The right answer of the question is, option D and that is, all of the above. Question number 3, which among the following have not been opened for private sector participation? The option A is, power sector. The option B is, telecommunication sector. The option C is, education sector. The option D is, railways. The right answer of the question is, option D and that is, railways. Question number 4, on which of the following items the value added tax is imposed? The option A is, directly on consumers. The option B is, on final stage of production. The option C is, on all stages from production to final sales. The option D is, none of the above. The right answer of the question is, option C and that is, on all stages from production to final sales. Question number 5, in which of the following countries the industrial evolution took place first? The option A is, France. The option B is, Germany. The option C is, England. The option D is, USA. The right answer of the question is, option C and that is, England. Question number 6, in which year the Accounting Standards Board of India was established? The option A is, 1970. The option B is, 1972. The option C is, 1973. The option D is, 1977. The right answer of the question is, option D and that is, 1977. Question number 7. X and Y are partners in a firm. They withdrew 1,500 and 1,000 rupees respectively on 15th day of every month for all the 12 months during 2009. Interest on drawings is chargeable at the rate of 10% per annum. What would be the interest on drawings respectively? The option A is, 1800 and 1200 rupees. The option B is, 900 and 600 rupees. The option C is, 18000 and 12000 rupees. The option D is, 150 and 100 rupees. 
The right answer of the question is, option B and that is, 900 and 600 rupees. Question number 8. If the purchase consideration is calculated by adding the various payments to be made. The method is called, the option A is, lump sum method. The option B is, net worth method. The option C is, net payments method. The option D is, value of shares method. The right answer of the question is, option C and that is, net payments method. Question number 9. The following relate to the shares of a company. Which of the following is the correct order? The option A is, issue, application, call and forfeiture. The option B is, application, call, forfeiture and issue. The option C is, call, issue, application and forfeiture. The option D is, forfeiture, application, issue and call. The right answer of the question is, option A and that is, issue, application, call and forfeiture. Question number 10. The final accounts of a manufacturing company generally include the following statements. 1. Balance sheet. 2. Manufacturing account. 3. Profit and loss account. 4. Trading account. 5. Profit and loss appropriation account The correct sequence in which the statements are prepared is. The option A is, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. The option B is, 2, 4, 3, 5, 1. The option C is, 5, 2, 4, 3, 1. The option D is, 1, 4, 3, 2, 5. The right answer of the question is, option B and that is, 2, 4, 3, 5, 1. Question number 11. The theory of revealed preference was propounded by which of the following author? The option A is, A. Marshall. The option B is, P. F. Drucker. The option C is, Paul Samuelson. The option D is, J. R. Hicks. The right answer of the question is, option C and that is, Paul Samuelson. Question number 12, which of the following concepts is considered as a myth? The option A is, oligopoly. The option B is, perfect competition. The option C is, monopoly. The option D is, imperfect competition. The right answer of the question is, option B and that is, perfect competition. Question number 13. A perfectly competitive market in the short run will be in equilibrium where, blank. The option A is, V and C equals AC. The option B is, MC equals Mr. The option C is, NC equals 0. The option D is, None of the above. The right answer of the question is, option B and that is, MC equals Mr. Question number 14. Two lists are given in this question. You have to match correct items of list 1 with correct items of list 2. The list 1, markets, contains the following items. A. Perfect competition. B. Monopolistic competition. C. Oligopoly. D. Monopoly. The list 2. Situations. Contains the following items. 1. No control. 2. Some control. 3. Practically some control. 4. Usual control. Below are given the options with different matches. You can pause the video and choose the appropriate answer. The right answer of the question is option. A. 
we suggest you to pause the video to analyze and learn the correct combination. Question number 15. Statement. A. The demand for the product of a firm under oligopoly is at prices higher than the prevailing market. Prices. Reason. R. The oligopolistic firm faces a kink demand curve. The option A is, both, A, and, R, are false. The option B is, both, A, and, R, are true, but, R, is not the correct explanation of, A. The option C is, A, is true, but, R, is false. The option D is, A, is false, but, R, is true. The right answer of the question is, option D and that is, A, is false, but, R, is true. Question number 16. In a factory, there are 1000 workers consisting of 400 A grade workers and 600 B grade workers. In a grade, 300 are male workers. And in B grade, only 200 are male workers. How many female workers are there in the factory? The option A is, 300. The option B is, 400. The option C is, 500. The option D is, 60. The right answer of the question is, option C and that is, 500. Question number 17. When a population is heterogeneous, it is divided into groups, so that there is homogeneity within the group and heterogeneity between the groups. And some items are selected at random from each group. It is a case of. The option A is, cluster random sampling. The option B is, systematic random sampling. The option C is, quota sampling. The option D is, stratified random sampling. The right answer of the question is, option D and that is, stratified random sampling. Question number 18, which one among the following is a small sample? The option A is, 5. The option B is, 10. The option C is, 29. The option D is, all the above. The right answer of the question is, option D and that is, all the above. Question number 19. Which one of the following softwares is used for research analysis? The option A is, SAP. The option B is, ERP. The option C is, SPSS. The option D is, Tally. The right answer of the question is, option C and that is, SPSS. Question number 20. Which one of the following is a database management system? The option A is, MS Access. The option B is, MS Excel. The option C is, MS Outlook. The option D is, none of the above. The right answer of the question is, option A and that is, MS Access. Question number 21. Two lists are given in this question. You have to match correct items of list 1 with correct items of list 2. The list 1. Author. Contains the following items. A. Maslow. B. Hertzberg. C. Alchi. D. McGregor. The list 2. Theory. Contains the following items. 1. Hygiene theory. 2. X and Y theory. 3. Need hierarchy theory. 4. Z theory. Below are given the options with different matches. You can pause the video and choose the appropriate answer. The right answer of the question is option. D. 
We suggest you to pause the video to analyze and learn the correct combination. Question number 22. Consider the following steps in the decision making process. And select the correct sequence. 1. Defining the problem. 2. Considering alternatives. 3. Considering limiting factors. 4. Selection of the best alternative and implementation. The option A is 1, 2, 2, 4. The option B is 3, 1, 4, 2. The option C is 1, 4, 3, 2. The option D is 1, 3, 4, 2. The right answer of the question is Option A and that is, 1, 2, 2, 4. Question number 23. Unity of objectives, principle states that there should be the following condition. The option A is, only one objective. The option B is, predetermined objectives. The option C is, coordination among objectives. The option D is, none of the above. The right answer of the question is, option C and that is, coordination among objectives. Question number 24. The concept of management by objective originally came from which of the following author? The option A is, F. W. Taylor. The option B is, A. H. Maslow. The option C is, Henry Fayol. The option D is, Peter F. Drucker. The right answer of the question is, option D and that is, Peter F. Drucker. Question number 25. Which one of the following is the most important principle of business ethics? The option A is, principle of unity of direction. The option B is, principle of proportional judgment. The option C is, principle of scalar chain. The option D is, Principle of span of control. The right answer of the question is, option B and that is, principle of proportional judgment. Question number 26. Two lists are given in this question. You have to match correct items of list 1 with correct items of list 2. The list 1. Statement. Contains the following items. A. Marketing is the delivery of standard of living. Dot. B. Marketing comprises both buying and selling activities. Dot. C. Marketing is human activity directed at satisfying needs and wants through exchange process. Dot. D. Marketing is a process which converts a resource. Distinct knowledge into a contribution of economic value in the marketplace. Dot. The list 2. Author. Contains the following items. 1. Peter F. Drucker. 2. Philip Kotler. 3. Paul Mazur. 4. Pyle. Below are given the options with different matches. You can pause the video and choose the appropriate answer. The right answer of the question is option C. We suggest you to pause the video to analyze and learn the correct combination. Question number 27. Which one of the following is not the mode of direct distribution system? The option A is trading mediators. The option B is vending machines. The option C is own sales depot. The option D is, franchise shops. The right answer of the question is, option A and that is, trading mediators. Question number 28. Which one of the following marketing offers and their process is matched correctly? The option A is, consumer promotion equals sales meetings. The option B is, 
dealer promotion equals display allowance. The option C is, internal sales promotion equals free samples. The option D is, none of the above. The right answer of the question is, option B and that is, dealer promotion equals display allowance. Question number 29. Statement. A. The electronic media has a strong impact on consumers' behavior in India. Reason. R. Most of the Indian consumers take their decision with the help of electronic media. The option A is, statement, A, is correct, but reason, R, is false. The option B is, reason, R, is correct, but statement, A, is false. The option C is, both statement, A, and reason, R, are false. The option D is, both statement, A, and reason, R, are correct. The right answer of the question is, option D and that is, both statement, A, and reason, R, are correct. Question number 30. Which of the following correctly explains the concept of road blocking advertisement? The option A is, advertising a product by blocking a road. The option B is, putting an advertisement on a blocked road. The option C is, a technique of gathering potential customers on the road. The option D is, advertising a product on all similar TV radio channels at the same time. The right answer of the question is, option D and that is, advertising a product on all similar TV, radio channels at the same time. Question number 31. Statement. 1. Working capital is the amount of funds necessary to cover the cost of operating the enterprise. Statement. 2. Circulating capital means current assets of a company that are changed in the ordinary course of business from one form to another. The option A is, 1, and, 2, both statements are correct. The option B is, 1, and, 2, both statements are false. The option C is, 1, is correct, but, E, is false. The option D is, 1, is false, but, E, is correct. The right answer of the question is, option A and that is, 1, and, 2, both statements are correct. Question number 32. Statement. 1. Payback period method measures the true profitability of a project. Statement. 2. Capital rationing and capital budgeting mean the same thing. Statement. 3. Internal rate of return and time adjusted rate of return are the same thing. Statement. 4. Rate of return method takes into account the time value of money. The option A is, statements, 1, 2, and, 2, are correct. The option B is, statements, 2, and, 3, are correct. The option C is, C, only, 3, is correct. The option D is, all statements are false. The right answer of the question is, option C and that is, C, only, 3, is correct. Question number 33. Statement. 1. A ratio is an arithmetical relationship of one number to another number. Statement. 2. Liquid ratio is also known as acid test ratio. Statement. 3. Rule of thumb for current ratio is 2. 1. Statement. 4. Debt equity ratio is the relationship between outsider's fund and shareholder's fund. The option A is, all statements are correct. The option B is, only statements, 1, 2, and, 3, are correct.
The option C is only statements 2, 3 and 4 are correct. The option D is only statements 2 and 3 are correct. The right answer of the question is option A and that is all statements are correct. Question number 34. Which of the following is the basic objective of financial management? The option A is maximization of profits. The option B is profit planning of the organization. The option C is maximization of shareholders wealth. The option D is ensuring financial discipline in the organization. The right answer of the question is, option C and that is, maximization of shareholders wealth. Question number 35. Which of the following term is used to represent the proportionate relationship between debt and equity? The option A is, cost of capital. The option B is, capital budgeting. The option C is, asset structure. The option D is, capital structure. The right answer of the question is, option D and that is, capital structure. Question number 36. The human resources management is amalgam of which of the following options? The option A is, job analysis, recruitment and selection. The option B is, Social behavior and business ethics. The option C is organizational behavior, personal management and industrial relation. The option D is employer and employees. The right answer of the question is option C and that is organizational behavior, personal management and industrial relation. Question number 37. Recruitment is concerned with the process of which of the following options? The option A is, selection of right candidate. The option B is, developing a pool of potential employees. The option C is, inviting applications for jobs. The option D is, none of the above. The right answer of the question is, Option B and that is, developing a pool of potential employees. Question number 38, the mechanism to identify employees growth potentials is done through. The option A is, job enrichment. The option B is, job evaluation. The option C is, job assessment center. The option D is, position description. The right answer of the question is, option A and that is, job enrichment. Question number 39. An interview conducted at the time of an employee leaving the organization is called. The option A is, exit interview. The option B is, feedback interview. The option C is, convincing interview. The option D is, directed interview. The right answer of the question is, option A and that is, exit interview. Question number 40. Statement. A. A manager delegates authority. Reason. R. The manager wants to shirk his responsibility. The option A is, both statement, A, and reason, R, are correct. The option B is, both statement, A, and reason, R, are false. The option C is, statement, A, is correct, but reason, R, is false. The option D is, statement, A, is false, but reason, R, is correct. The right answer of the question is, option C and that is, statement, A, is correct. But reason, R, is false. Question number 41. Two lists are given in this question. 
You have to match correct items of list 1 with correct items of list 2. The list 1. Banks. Contains the following items. A. Unit Trust of India. B. Banking Regulation Act. C. Imperial Bank of India. D. Nabard. The list 2. Year of Establishment. Contains the following items. 1. 1921. 2. 1949. 3. 1964. 4. 1982. Below are given the options with different matches. You can pause the video and choose the appropriate answer. The right answer of the question is option D. We suggest you to pause the video to analyze and learn the correct combination. Question number 42. Capital adequacy norms declared in the year 1996 is applicable to the option A is foreign banks. The option B is cooperative banks. The option C is private sector banks. The option D is nationalized bank. The right answer of the question is option D and that is nationalized bank. Question number 43. Which one of the following is used for international money transfer? The option A is RTGS. The option B is NEFT. The option C is SWIFT. The option D is none of the above. The right answer of the question is option C and that is SWIFT. Question number 44. In order to control credit and investment, the central bank of a country should do the following. The option A is, sell securities in the open market and hike the cash reserve ratio. The option B is, buy securities from the open market and lower the cash reserve ratio. The option C is, buy securities from the open market and hike the cash reserve ratio. The option D is, sell securities in the open market and lower the cash reserve ratio. The right answer of the question is, option A and that is, sell securities in the open market and hike the cash reserve ratio. Question number 45. India has been witnessing high rate of inflation because of which of the following reasons? The option A is, public expenditure and money supply both are continuously increasing. The option B is, the agricultural and industrial sectors have not performed adequately. The option C is, both agricultural and administered prices have been hiked. The option D is, all of the above. The right answer of the question is, Option D and that is, all of the above. Question number 46. In India, blank, has a predominant share in the debt market. The option A is, government securities. The option B is, corporate deposits. The option C is, corporate equities. The option D is, global depository receipts. The right answer of the question is, option A and that is, government securities. Question number 47. Which type of elasticity plays a crucial role in determining international trade? The option A is, elasticity of demand. The option B is, price elasticity of demand. The option C is, income elasticity of demand. The option D is, Cross elasticity of demand. The right answer of the question is, option B and that is, price elasticity of demand. Question number 48, which of the following is the full form of DFEC? The option A is, direct foreign exchange control. 
The option B is direct finance exchange control. The option C is duty free export credit. The option D is duty free exchange credit. The right answer of the question is option C and that is duty free export credit. Question number 49. Suppose a Canadian firm imports bananas of $1000 and sells them for $2000. The effect on GDP would be. The option A is, the GDP will decrease by $3000. The option B is, the GDP will increase by $3000. The option C is, the GDP will increase by $2000. The option D is, the GDP will increase by $1000. The right answer of the question is, option D and that is, the GDP will increase by $1000. Question number 50. In independent India, the first major foreign exchange crisis occurred in the year, blank. The option A is, 1955. The option B is, 1956. The option C is, 1969. The option D is, 1991. The right answer of the question is, option B and that is, 1956.